What is up everybody, it is the Megalodon or the Mankey and we are here today for another episode on the Pixelmon Indigo server on the Pokeplay.io server. So as you can see last episode we have finished one island and we are now moving on to two island which was just released yesterday I think. Let's do it. There are also a pair of boots that are meant to be hidden on uh, one island and lots of people have um, uh, uh, found them but I and they even say it's really easy but I haven't found them and I've even got jailed uh, for asking so yeah that uh, I think I'm just giving up to run I'm throwing the towel let's go to island let's have a C so let's have a look techno is also here Looks like it's a Shadow Lugia, nice. Okay, let's first head to the Poke Center. I wish they would like create warp to the Savvy Islands themselves, because right now the only way is to go to um, Vermilion City and then get them, but I wish there was an easier way. Wait, this is my first time on two islands. Have a look at. What's it, there's a Poke Loot here. PP up. Um, uh, it's, I might give it a shuckle, I don't know, I'm just going to keep it for now. Have a look in this house, if there's anything special in here. Mm. No, it doesn't seem like it. it, looks like all these houses are plain, useless pieces of junk. There seems to be some stairs over here. Let's go up these stairs. Actually, there's some more stalls uh, over here. Let's first check out these stalls. Who knows? Maybe it was a typo and the boots are actually on two island. Who knows? Who knows? There's a grave over here. What? Place of spirit tomb. Interesting. Wonder if I just all that? I think I might have. Wait, is that pinks or what? Oh, uh, did you? <laughs> oh, is it yours? <laughs> I I just really don't know. Maybe. Oh, okay. I can have it. Okay, thanks, thanks, thanks. But actually, I don't really need it either because I already have a, um, what's it called, a shiny spirit tomb. So, I don't really need it either. Let's see. I have a lot of spirits in this. There must be somewhere in the main island of Kanto or Jojo's old relics. There must be a place some, um, well, I actually can't think on the top of my head where would, se where would uh, the place sell old relics. Imagine it's gonna be a shop, right? I, mean, I, I guess so, alright. Let's have a look what else is on this island. So far, it's not been too useful. Oh. I'm gonna catch every Pokemon that I can possibly. I'm at, running out of Quick Balls actually. I, I'm probably gonna have to restock. There's a Patch Reese over there. Um, okay, let's see, on the court. I'm gonna catch this little. Oh, they're, they're, they're all over. Um, Level 200, maybe, maybe that's why they're so hard to catch with the Quick Ball. But, then again, Quick Balls are really stinking overpowered, so it shouldn't be too hard to catch them. Spiro, Bell Sprout, or Weeping Bells, Chatot, ooh, I, I need one of these, I don't, I haven't uh, caught, caught one of those yet. Seems to be a house with a Pokeloot over here. After this, I might go back to Goldenrod City just to restock on some Quick Balls because currently I am running out a little bit and this shit doesn't want to be caught. It just doesn't. It legitimately doesn't. Right, I have four more left. Thing is, it, it, they have such a high catch rate. I don't, I don't get how um, it hasn't been caught yet. So the Quick Ball again. Come on. Yes, okay, we got it, we got it, we got it. Um, there's a Pokeloot. Tiny Mushroom, absolutely useless. 
Um, and oh, check of TV. A wild. Oh, so this one there to okay. Interesting. Now I might actually wind up using my one of my uh, master balls if I can't catch this guy. Oh, I might have to use my master ball. Now, this is my last quick ball. If it doesn't catch, I'm going to use master ball. Oh, it caught. Okay, thank goodness. Alrighty, and uh, uh, how seems like it's boosted apart from that. I'm going to go back to uh, Jodo spawn. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and buy another 64 quick balls. Um, but yeah, I've been spending a lot of hours on the server just to find the new boots, and from what I can tell, they're just nowhere to be found. Like, I can't find them for the life of me. Uh, legit. Some say it's really easy, but I think they're just pulling my leg. I'm pretty sure it is still pretty hard to find. Because when you do something, everyone says, oh, it's pretty easy, it's pretty easy. But when you actually do it, you think it's easy, but it's actually still pretty hard. Right, let's buy 64 of these bad boys right here. We're about to Kanto spawn. Uh, let's put these in our inventory so we don't accidentally throw them. And let us go. Oh, okay. Let us go back to um, um, yeah, to the Savvy Island, two islands. So let's go back to them. So this is what I'm talking about. They should have a warp to the Savvy Island. Even if it's just a warp to one island, it's gonna be more bad than this. So right, you have to go to Kanto, then you have to go to Vermilion. Well, unless you're already at Vermilion, then you need to go over here past the Shamuti Islands, and then finally to the Sevi Islands. It's really, really obnoxious. It looks like someone's got Metagross, which makes me QQ because I spent a lot on my Metagross. Uh, but whatever, you know, uh, you learn, you learn. Did I just see a spark? No, I didn't. Okay, might be just imagining things. Anyway, I think I also see something up here. Oh, looks like this time the uh, the thing, the island challenge pretty easy. Strength. All right, let's take the trials. Sky battle claws, bag claws, inverse battle claws. I'm going to do this uh, opposite. All right, let's try the inverse battle claws first. Inverse battle means type advantages are reversed. Fascinating. Have a see what this guy's up to. Okay. Let's set up. Giga Drain. So what's something that's not very effective against um, grass? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, what's something that's not very effective against grass? Go into Pixelmon uh, Wiki. Let's check Meganium. What's something that's not very effective against Meganium? Oh, I can't spell Meganium right. There we go, finally. Um, let's see, it's not very electric, grass, ground. So let's go ahead and switch into um, Jolteon and hit him with the Thunderbolt. Super effective. Oh, but it's into um, a lot? Are you kidding me? Dude, come on. Alright, finally. Cloitza. What's not very effective against him? Um, Ice or fire? So let's switch into um, Nine Tails and hit him with the flamethrower. There we go. Pretty nice. Uh, Pashirisu. Uh, what's is grass? Please say grass. Uh, it's a neutral. Um, might just hit him with the flamethrower to be honest. It's a neutral. It's burnt. Oh, I'm paralyzed. Are you kidding me? U-turn. Which is a glisscore. 
Honestly, that is so cheap. Gliscor. And I've only taken out two Pokemon, so like I'm not a woods yet either. Um Grass isn't that good. Ah, oh, okay, that's really annoying. We we want fighting bug. Fighting or bug? Um I don't have any bug types, so I guess I'm gonna send this guy up here with the aura sphere. Oh, it didn't even do that much. Come on. Let's go for the aura sphere. F facade? F I don't even know how to pronounce that, jeez. Um, wait, but if it's inverse, does it mean that zero times effective earthquakes gonna be super effective against him? I'm not gonna risk it. And I'm just gonna hit him with a meteor mash. But oh. wood, okay. Dragon pulse, come on. No, that's not gonna work. Okay. Ah, uh, yep, I failed. Um, I need a poison opa. Oh what? Oh, Jolti, I'm still alive. <laughs> well, actually, this is a good opportunity to test. Is Oh wow, so like it is that oh okay. That's interesting. So is this like one of those situations where I can only battle it every twenty-four hours or is it gonna be like no you can just immediately verse again? Because it would be really annoying if I can only verse those every twenty-four hours. Um, I'm also going to switch out Mewtwo because it pretty much did nothing. I'm gonna bring in Heracross wherever he is. Uh, where's Heracross? Where's Heracross? Uh, where's Her There he is, Heracross. Okie dokie. And sh should I bring in the other Shuckle? No, let's see, I don't think it's worth. Oh, okay, and it doesn't look like okay. Alright, let's try this again. Is this gonna work? Oh, I forgot. He's. Oh my god, okay. What? Train the TP. Okay, I have no idea what he's talking about. Um. Oh, well, that's annoying. And then what's this train of TP about? Or whatever, I guess. I'm gonna have to go through that all over again. Uh, I also need to bring my levels up a little, because my levels are looking really weak. So I'm gonna spend the, these out uh, evenly across my team. I have a 94, so that's... Um, that would be around 94 divided by 6 is around uh, 15 each and 4 extra, alright. So we, we can afford to let everyone get to 250, level 215. So... Alrighty, Shuckle, you're done. Kingdra, you can get to level 15. Oh, level 215, sorry. Um, a few more levels. One more, okay. Heracross, you're gonna get to level 50, 20, 215. Look how much level it requires if I need to level up normally. I might have to buy some rare candies for someone. Alrighty, Heracross, you're done. Metagross, I'm actually going to raise you up to level 219 because you are a really good member. Alrighty. And finally, uh, Ninetales going to get to level 215. Oh, I just retrieved him. Alrighty, and then the rest go on Jolteon. Alright. Alrighty, uh, hopefully this, these levels are going to be enough for me to defeat that guy, because uh, it... Um, they are pretty tough. Anyone selling red candies? Looks like no one is. Okay, it's it's not it's no bother. It's no bother. Um, let's go ahead and try to verse that guy again. Myself. <laughs> like, 
I can't even at this point. Okay, um, Shuckle's not going to be able to do a lot. I mean, it's only used for setting up after all. Uh, let's go for the, and let's let's go ahead and battle some of the other trainers that were apparent on this uh, what's it called on this challenge temple thingy majiga. Let's try back claws. Back claws shouldn't be pretty hard. I mean, I don't really use items anyway. Durant, Iron Head, okay, thank goodness for the avoid. Sticky Web, let's go with a Stealth Rock. Ooh, oh, Flinch, are you serious? Oh my god, are you serious? Alright, so now with Nine Tails, him with the Flame. What? How is he so fast? I guess he is like dead levels ahead of me, but man, that is fast. Okay, let's go for the Earthquake, X Sizzle. Really now. Let's go for a bullet punch. I flosion. It's not enough. Tell someone quick just to finish him off. Gastrodon. What level is he? He's water ground. That's annoying. That's annoying because I, I've lost my grass attack. Um, this guy can't really do much. I don't know if he has sticky hold sand force or storm drain, so I don't know how much um, Kingdra could really do. Let's just sack him. And just sack him. Let's switch to Heracross, hit him with a close combat, I would say. Into my highest damage dealing move. Oh, no, no. Is that, oh, it's not gonna be enough. And because I decreased my. Oh, okay, that was. Oh, but he burnt me! That's such a cheese. Ah. Uh, rip. I can still try and pose him. St oh, sapped. Oh. Oh, let's have lost. Alright, looks like I need to uh, level up my Pokemon a little bit because they do look pretty under leveled. So I'm just going to quickly go ahead and uh, do some hunting and things. No, actually, no. Let's explore the rest of the island. Just because I can't take on that temple doesn't mean I can't have fun with the rest of the island. Let's have a little look. A uh, slow bird, boss rat, Persian, Oddish, uh, Goldark, Oddish, Pachirisu, bunch of that normal stuff. Um, dude, this island looks pretty small. Like, there's not a lot for me to go. Over there's just gravel, and gravel means that that's the end of the path. It's not really anything over here either. Yeah, this island doesn't really have um, anything. Those two islands, in comparison, is way bigger than this island. Unless there's like something hiding in the corner over here. I doubt it though, I doubt it. Um, I really do. Uh, but we might as well check. Cause there's no harm in doing. Six K per ca no, come on. I uh, make it five. Can I make it five K? Come on. Make it five K. Uh, this is really horrible as for me because I normally sell it at seven K a piece. But um, you know, I gotta save money. I mean, I only have around eight point five million left. Uh, so how many do I need if I were to buy them? Uh, so uh, I need 40, I need 
which is mm, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, let me check. Thirty-five, thirty-five times. Five times six, and then plus four. We need two hundred fourteen, and if that times that by five, that's around one million. That is way too much for my. Uh, no, and, but I mean like then I get to power level, and I don't know like good place for power leveling. Uh, more than. Two stacks. I need two hundred and fourteen. I might honestly uh, go and start hunting, and then I'll catch you guys back in a little bit once I've leveled. What well, is up, everybody? It is the Megalodon or the Magia, and we're here today for another episode of the Pokeplay Indigo server on the Sevi Island. So. They get straight into it. We're going to Sky Battle Club. How do you know what that is? What's Sky? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta search this out on my second screen. Uh, let's go Bulbapedia. Sky, uh, Sky Battle Course. What's Sky Battle Course? Um, I actually don't know at all. That's a bit of an issue. But as you can see, uh, I have leveled up my Pokemon by a lot. So Kingdra, Heracross, and Metagross are max level. Ninetales is almost max level. Jolteon and Shuckle still has some levels to go. Um, but I think in the end they'll get there quickly. I just want to know what Sky they only allow certain Pokemon to. Oh, that's a bummer. It's really big. Okay, I guess what I'm going to have to do. I'm just going to have to uh, lose this battle so I can quickly go back to the two island PC because I don't want to go to Vermilion City and then come back here and do all that again. Right, let's just oh you no, okay it won't allow me to do it. Um, let's see how about we got so set like Aerodactyl Aerodactyl uh where was it again uh here it is all right Aerodactyl for sure it's allowed yeah it's allowed. This is confirm and then lose to this really quickly. Oh, it's mega evolving. Luckily, I hope it doesn't have any like good Pokemon, because if it does, that's gonna be a big issue. Even if I get a new team. Yep, it's fainted. Oh come on! Ah, oh, it's, it's because ah, oh, that's that's a big rip. Yeah, let's put all of these Pokemon in. Let's poke heal and let's battle once in my oh jeez. Oh, actually, he just got hurt. If I, where, where, where was this? If I faint him through a suffocating, maybe he's gonna. Right, where was the spot again? Come on! All right, there it is. Oh, he moved down. He's a smart person. Right, right. If if we could just keep doing this, that trainer's still at Aerodactyl. Like, what the hell is he doing? Okay. Right, if we just keep doing this and any second now. Mm, no, it doesn't work. Ah, oh, that is a huge annoyance. Okay, PC and let's put our Pokemon back out. Oh, I like them in a certain order. I don't want to mix up their order. Right, let's get Kingdra back. And let's uh, slash Kanto spawn. Alrighty, and now let us uh, go ahead and just go back to the original. This is going to take a lot of time, but yeah, it looks like this. I only have two options. I either create a new Sky Battle team or Chin's House. Anyone can anyone lend me their team they use for s Sky Battling. Uh, I won't be surprised if no one wants to, but I might ask in the Discord uh, later if, uh, if someone's kind enough to lend me or lease me. Their team that they use for uh, sky battling, because I really don't want to create a new team. Getting the Pokemon and then leveling them up to 250 is going to be a real issue. I can't even level these up to level 250, let alone a new team of 6. Because from what I can tell, none of these 6 Pokemon 
are uh, suitable for Sky. Oh, Heracross may no, it's it's bug fighting. It's not. Yeah, so none of these Pokemon that I have currently are suitable for Sky battling, uh, which is a huge issue right now that I have to deal with. But uh, at least even if Sky battling doesn't work, we could um, try some of the other uh, two. I think one's Bad Claws and one's Inverse Battle. Alright, let's try the Bad Claws one first, because like. I never really bring potions or revives into battle anyway. I managed to buy some uh, in between videos to use on uh, the inverse battle or the sky battle. Ready? Right, let's try this one. It's only got four Pokemon. Right, as always, now with Shuckle. Jolton is not going to be too much help there because he is under level Durant. Let's go with that Sticky Web. Sturdy, doing a lot. Right, uh, I'm pretty sure we won't get it. Yep. Uh, let's try nine tails. Hit him with the flame. F oh, I forgot about that. Uh, what do we do now? I guess Metagross with an earthquake. Oh, I can avoid the attack. Thank goodness. Okay. Now let's go with that bullet punch. There we go. Typhlosion. It's going to use a fire move, so we're going to switch to Kingdra. Oh, wow. That still did a lot. Uh, if it's uh, only a quarter effective. Gastrodon. What type is Gastrodon? Water ground. What a strange Pokemon. Water ground. Uh, it's grass. Unfortunately, Nine Tails has already fainted early in this battle, so we can't exactly use Nine Tails. Hmm. I guess just go for the Dragon Pulse. Oh, if you get really hit with Skull, then I might as well set up with uh, Focus Energy. Oh, what? Why did you use Earthquake that time? Come on. And the burn killed. Jesus Christ, where's my luck? Right, let's start with. Her uh, I don't know. Let's use Heracross. Um, and then go with Knockoff. At least Knockoff, whatever held item he's using. Come on. Do a lot. I did a decent amount. Leftovers. Okay, recover. That's. A huge issue. All right, let's go with that close combat. Well, that did a lot. <laughs> okay, that didn't do over half, so we're good. Zapdos. Uh, let's switch to Metagross. Probably gonna use a flying move. No, why would he? Uh, okay. Let's go Meteor Mash. Wow, that is absolutely trash. All right, thank God Heat Wave avoided. Let's go to Zen Headbutt. I think it might do more. Oh, yeah, that did a lot more. Oh, but he waved to the lot. I think because we're paralyzed, we go second. No! Yeah, let's send out with Jolteon. Zapdos has the Volt Absorb ability. Let me check. If it does, it's going to be a huge issue. No, it doesn't. Okay. So Thunderbolt. Oh, Roost. Oh, are you serious? Alright, let's go Thunderbolt again. Heat Wave. Okay, we, we've killed Zapdos. Alright, and we've won. Okay. This is good. This is good. Oh, that was close. Okay, okay let's go. Poke heal. Oh, this heal is here for um, trainers. That's pretty good. Let's go ahead and initiate with the second battle. Alrighty. Uh, let's go with the same. It doesn't really matter, I guess, the order. But anyway, alright, Golem. Sticky web. Oh, actually, we should probably toxic him because he's probably got sturdy. So, ooh, okay, that was a critical hit. Alrighty, I knew that was going to happen. Right, now let's send out with uh, Kingdra. Alright, Riker. He's got an air balloon, which is really annoying. Let's go with the Surf just to pop that air balloon. Thunder. I can't believe that actually hit. Surf, okay, that had a decent amount, and it popped his air balloon. That's the important thing. Okay, let's switch to uh, Metagross in with an Earthquake. Scald. Okay, Arcanine. Should we go... Uh, our attacks decrease, but let's go for the Earthquake anyway. Oh, so close. Yes, so far. We've lost our key player. Right, let's send out with Meta uh, Heracross because he's got a lot of coverage. Dunsparce, what type is Dunsparce? He is normal type. That's perfect. That's perfect. Okay, so all we need to do is go for the close combat, and it de should definitely be a one-hit KO. Or an Oko. Alright, oh, the Omega Evolution screen takes so long though. Okay, come on. Yes, alright, that's done. Pelipper. Or the flying. I can't do much. We're gonna use a flying type move. We need Jolteon for this. But. 
Um, let's just knock off whatever item it's using. Damp Rock. Not sure what that's doing. And the, the, of course the Hurricane has to hit. Alright. Jolteon, go with Thunderbolt. Yep, there we go. We won again. Alrighty. And I think, yep, we ba complete Battle Circuit 2. Now we might as well try the, the third one, the Inverse Battle. Oh, it's going to be tough. And it, I'm pretty sure we have to battle three trainers, so it's going to be really, really annoying. Slowbro, might as well take it out. Uh, the slow bros and Golducks are pretty good XP, so I'm gonna take them out whenever I have the chance. Well, to be honest, they're nowhere as effective as Rare Candy, which is what I'm using right now to level these guys up. All right, trial three. Let's try that again. Uh, Invisibility. Yep, I know that. Alrighty, let's see. First one only has four Pokemon. Shouldn't be too tough. Meganium. Let's go for Sticky Web. Uh, let's go with that Stealth Rock, Giga Drain, uh, let's go with that Toxic, ooh, Critical Hit, okay, hopefully I can get the rest out, oh, okay, 17 health, but I got the rest, okay, that's pretty decent, now let's keep stalling him, he's gonna use Synthesis, but it's not gonna work, uh, let's try to, yeah, let's just try to stall kill him, oh, Aromatherapy, oh my god, it's so annoying, okay, Right, let's toxic him again. I'm not sure what the PP on the Rome therapy is. I think it's it's five. Honestly, I'm not sure. Oh, that is so annoying. Um, let's, let's, let's try the toxic again. And while it's aromatherapy, we're gonna switch. Oh, I thought it was. Oh, what? Why did not use aromatherapy then? That's so annoying. All right, let's try solar beam. Oh, it's not even that effective. Okay, what's also not effective against Meganium, normally. Uh, Jolteon, Jolteon, uh, Electric, Electric it normally isn't that effective against Grass. Oh, but um, he's only level 216. Might as well give it a shot. I mean, he's, he's choice spec, so shouldn't, alright. Cloyter, so he is water. So that that's not what we want for Jolteon because it's inverse, so we actually want fire, but um, yeah, nine tails dead. I guess we gotta switch to Metagross and hit him with an earthquake. Dark Pulse is not very effective. Good switch. Let's actually go with Meteor Mash. Yep, Gliscor. Oh, um, uh, what's it called? Uh, earthquake normally is not effective at all against him, but if we use it here, that means it should mean it's super effective. Yep, good job. Are you serious? He's gonna roost. Oh, that's so annoying. But I'm pretty sure uh, Roost and Earthquake both have... Uh... Oh, but but he's got the Toxin. Alright, let's get some Medium Mash in. Uh, try to raise my attack, if possible. Fa facade. Okay, that's really... Of course, the one time he's gonna use Earthquake, that is so obnoxious. It's like the game knows what I'm trying to do. So now it's jolting on him with Thunderbolt. Right. Pashirisu. Now, does Pash. Oh, I, I gained level. Nice. Right. Does Pashirisu have the Volt Absorb ability? So I wanna know. If it doesn't. Um. Uh, actually, no. Oh, it does have Volt Absorb. Oh, that's so annoying. Super Fang. Oh, that's gonna be annoying. Oh, let's switch to Shuckle. Okay, super fine. It's doing a lot. Let's toxic him. Uh, oh, you use toxic on me? What? Okay. Nuzzle. Okay. But at least I can rest it out. He can't. Super fine. Okay. So as long as we just keep doing this, uh, we should be able to take him out. Nuzzle. And then, yep, we're still sleeping. Hopefully he doesn't have like a healing move of some sort. Let's rest it out. And then what's he gonna use? He's gonna Super Fang again. Alright, and there we want. Nice, alright, that's the uh, the first uh, trainer defeated. Let's go Pokey Heal. And let's try to verse the second trainer. Let's see, alright, so it sounds so cool. No, 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 wait. Let's not get this confused. A bomber snow, he's ice, so we want we want um we don't want fire. Alright, wood hammer, okay. 
go with stealth. Oh, it's not gonna matter. Right. We don't want fire. We want. A, uh, we want. Uh, thing is, it's a risk sending him out because grass is effective, but then fire. He's super effective against me. I guess now Metagross is going to be the optimal move. Or King, actually, yeah, Kingdra. Let's start with the focus energy. <gasps> oh, they're so close. Okay. I'm gonna die to hail anyway, so it's like, oh, I shot. That is such a cheek. Okay. Guess we have no choice but to now Metagross for that. Um, Earthquake. I shot. Did not see that coming. Right, Earthquake's done it. Clefable. Now. Hmm. Steel normally super fights against Clefable, but in this case, not going to be very not effective against Clefable. I guess I'd switch to Heracross and hit him with a close combat. It's going to be the best shout here. Stealth Rock. Okay, at least it doesn't get his chance to minimize or sell with Cosmic Power. Let's Mega Evolve. And let's hit him with a close combat. It should knock him out. Alrighty. Garchomp. Um, what's not very effective against Garchomp? <laughs> I'm always looking at what's not very effective. Uh, I guess we've got to use... Uh, let's just charge close combat at him. Ooh, that's a decent amount. Critical hit, of course. Okay. I don't think Jolteon is going to be fast enough. Is it? It's a little too... Let, let's say it's fast enough, because it does have a higher base speed. Yep. Articuno. That is certainly annoying. Um, now, I want to switch to Nine Tails, but if you use an... I but you should use a flying move, actually. Oh, the flying move land. The one time Hurricane lands. God. Oh my god, it's... How's Hurricane so accurate over us? I swear whenever I use it, it never works. Right, I avoid, finally avoid that awesome. On the one Pokemon which can't do anything, I'd avoid it. Well, right, avoid... Worse RNG. Literally worse RNG. I don't even have anything that can heal. Uh, yep, yeah, I'm down for. I'm officially down for. Shadow Ball, and we're dead. Ah, oh, that is a real shame. Come on, the RNG was such against me. Looks like the game is cheating and knows what I want to do. Uh, anyway, uh, but there is, we, we are going to end this on a high because I have found out where those boots are on one island. Or rather, someone has told me where the boots are on one island. So let's send out Metagross and let's start swimming in the water. Oh, get out of the wall. Okay. Also, want to look out for any mud kips along the way. Alrighty, so on the back of this island, uh, there is a little cave you see up the hill. You come into this cave. Da, there's a sign. Pick up the Depth Strider boots. Alright, so we got these Thunderstone boots with Depth Strider 10, so we can throw our old boots away. So there we have our new boots. That is ending this out on a higher. It's pretty good. Let's go in the water and let's test it to make sure it does actually work and it's not a huge scam. Oh, hidden Pokemon. Oh, it's just my start. That's absolutely useless. All right, let's have a swim. Yeah, it feels a lot faster. Okay, so that is a very good news, but everyone, thanks so much for watching.